Hello, I'm Peter here. I just want to give you a quick a bit of advice on what I would do if I was going to purchase a Land Cruiser with a 1VD V8 turbo diesel in it. I get a lot of people that have only had it a couple of weeks, a month, whatever the case may be, and then they've found out they're up for an engine replacement, which is probably one of the most expensive repairs you'll ever do on a passenger vehicle. It's, there's a lot involved and it's quite expensive. So if I was going to purchase one of the three engine checks I would make without a doubt is I would want to get there first thing in the morning when it's as cold as possible. Make sure you feel the radiator that the vehicle has not been started at all that day. And I would start it and make sure it fires straight into life perfectly, sits there, idles perfectly. Any diesel that has any compression issue, it will always show up on a cold start. So really listen carefully, make sure that, you, that it just starts and idles, no smoke, sits there beautifully, no noise. That will give you a bit of an indication on compression timing, that sort of thing. The next thing I'd do is I'd wanna make sure I got the injector scan. Not so much to check the injectors, but just to check to make sure that they're not compensating for any loss of compression, anything like that. Just make sure they're sitting nice and even, everything, that looks a bit of a health check as well but it gives you a bit of a heads up as, as to where to go. The next thing I would do, and this is probably the most important thing and it'll give you the most information, especially when it comes to the 200 series and dusting. Obviously they have two turbos, the 70 series only have one. To check the intake side of the turbo is extremely important. On the 200s, it always seems to hammer the left hand as much, well, a lot more than it does the right. So, if I wanted to buy one, I, I would want a photo of the intake side of that turbo. I'll put a photo up of a worn turbo. That will give you any indication as far as if it's had any dusting issues at all, will always show up on the intake side of the turbo. The blades will wear. It's basically like someone's held a sandblaster there. On a new one, you'll see all the corners of the blades are nice and sharp, they're square. Once you've had dusting come through, they will all round off. The curve will happen on the point of the blade and you'll also, also get a, a gap between the blade and the wall. So it's extremely important. That is the one thing I would want to see. Someone with some sort of camera that can get down and just take a photo, pop the, the pipe off, have a look, but that would be an absolute must. So it doesn't matter what vehicle you are, if you've got a turbo, a Hilux Prado, whatever, and you want a pre-purchase inspection, make sure you get a photo of that because that'll tell you a lot. These are checks to make so that you save money in the end. If there's any way I can help or you need to replace one, please give me a call.